Tuesday morning. It is Tuesday the 7th of September. And um, I don't know how I'm going to piece this together. I don't know if I'm going to show what we were doing before. In fact, no, I'm not going to do that. Let me start from the beginning, okay? Good morning, guys. Um, I am... What's the time now? It's 10.30 in the morning. Funny enough, I actually have a few calls that I need to do. Look at this space. I just love my... Like what i've always dreamed of like it just looks so simple and so clean and so lovely but anyway guys it is tuesday it is a new morning i've just come off of a meeting call of which i will insert the clips now i think she even like still in bed because it's one hour i'm one hour earlier than you oh so no worries yeah you don't, you don't need to listen you don't need to apologize it's totally fine i'm still here no makeup my face isn't even done <laughs> i look dry <laughs> But it's okay. We're here anyway. It's, it's fine. What we're here for is for the updates and for the work. So it's totally fine. But um, yeah, I was just going to say it's good to be back. Thank you so much for being patient with me as well. Um, just as I kind of like have been navigating and sorting out other stuff. Um, and then taking some time off because I really just needed to take some time off. I wanted to kind of touch base with you guys. Make sure, you know, how, see how you guys have been over the past few weeks. See what's been going on, what you've been up to, how you feel like the page is doing, that sort of thing as well in terms of socials. And then I've got a few updates on my side. But yeah, you start first and let me know what's been happening. Okay. Um, with the power class, yeah. um, Instagram, I think um, it's actually been growing quite well. Um, I think we're nearly at like 2,000 followers. Um, so the last couple of weeks, um, I kind of, um, I'm not sure if you've seen, like, change the way I've been posting. Before it used to be the case where aesthetic was like, you know, you have to have like a tile effect or have a particular look. But now it doesn't matter as much. But I definitely do feel that as a whole, like just because we are still building. Um, and what I always say to people is when you are still building your page and you're trying to get more people to follow you, think about everything. Because yeah. even if, for example, someone just follows you, like I follow sometimes people's pages just because I like their aesthetic. That's mm. it. It might not even be because their content is crazy interesting or they have anything on there that I'm like, oh my gosh, I've never heard of this information before. I literally yeah. sometimes would just follow it because of their aesthetic. Debating, right? So with these, I was really debating for ages, mm -hmm. like, should they be fitted? Should they not be? Whatever it is. Um, but no, they're fitted. So let me actually hang this and go through each one. Because I haven't even really, really properly looked at it myself either. And apologies for my little shorts, but you know, mm -hmm. hey-ho. It's the morning, of course. Um, but yeah, so that's the actual blazer itself. Um, and this is how it comes. Mm -hmm. But the only thing is, it obviously has like their tag on it and i'm gonna see if i can find either somebody to replace them or even if i can do it myself to basically yeah. get labels yeah. um like power wear collection labels and then get these as well it's a bit thicker i don't know how to kind of describe it it's a it's a little bit heavier than the other ones which i prefer think kind of like karen millen so it's still affordable for most people but it's still um you know yeah. still a little bit you know not, not it's not cheap it's not you know Pricey. it's not yeah. cheap if you get what i mean yeah. i was, it, um, was the white and the pink and the, the greenish color was it um different prices um so yes they were okay. good morning hope you're all doing well and wonderful as you can see i've been on a meeting call this morning and the person that's on the call just uh i think their internet did something or whatever it is so they are let me lift you guys a little bit Sorry guys, I've opened the window because I feel really hot. It's really warm. Today actually... Yeah. There you go. Much better. <clears throat> it's actually very, very warm. So I've opened up the window, so I do apologise for all the noise. But this is a vlog, so it doesn't need to be perfect. Um, as you would have seen, I'm on our morning meeting call. Well, only with... <laughs> Babe! <laughs> looking at some stuff which i'm 
super excited. Um, now, I was going to launch this and just do it as a thing of like, guys, it's just happening. Not tell anybody and just surprise you guys. But something that I have really um, come to understand is that it's so important to show people, and I've always done this, but it's so important to show people your process because I think some people just see something, see the end result, and they're just like, boom, like, yeah, you know, that's it. But I really want to show you guys a process of an extension, another arm of the things that I do. As you can tell, I'm a serial entrepreneur. It is what it is. I like to make money. I like to find new ways to make money. And thank God I have come to a place where I've been blessed enough to have a platform and I've built a community. Um, and I've built, you know, a, a space where I'm able to say, hey, if I want to wake up tomorrow and start selling, I don't know, socks, I'll be able to do that. Um, so the new venture at the moment, okay, is selling suits. It's actually something that I've been doing for months. I've been doing research, looking at different places I can get them from, having loads of different phone calls, consultations, and I finally managed to find somewhere. Now, I'm not going to give you guys all the details because I also think that it's really important to make sure that some things are kept to myself. But what I am going to give you guys is the first kind of look. Um, and you would have seen anyway when I was talking to Amy, which is one of my girls from the Power Class um, team. And um, we were talking about, you know, number one, the program relaunching. Number two, we were talking about the suits that I wish to launch as well, which you can see hanging here. Um, but that's like the first, I guess, like visual representation of the suits that we have. Um, but ultimately, anyone that knows me knows that I love wearing suits. Like, that's my thing. I feel, I can't lie, I feel most confident and comfortable in a suit. I feel like um, it just makes me feel powerful. It makes me feel like I can do anything. I'm a boss babe, boss chick when I put on a suit. Like, it just, for me, it just works. It's like the easiest way to look like you're really dressed up without even necessarily trying. You just fling on the trousers, fling on the blazer, and you look dressed up. Um, and my main thing with, as you know, with the power class is all about empowering women and encouraging women to walk in their power because we are amazing. And I feel like too many women forget who they are when God intended for us to walk in our glory and in our power and to make impact on the world. And I believe that that comes from yes within, but also the way that you present yourself and the way that you look. Hence why I wanted to start the power suit. Um, so yeah, the power suit essentially um are just suits of different colors now these colors might change i'm not too sure if i want to change the colors and also obviously this is the first one but the first sample that we're getting um and at the moment this material ain't it especially if i'm trying to sell these suits are like you know more premium prices this flimsy material someone could go to a pretty little thing and buy this no offense pretty little thing but sometimes your stuff is a bit flimsy just saying but i still buy from there i still love it because it's cheap okay so um, whereas this suit is a little bit more like you can tell look at the difference between this and that Look at the way that this is flopping and look at that. You can tell it's a bit heavier So I actually prefer this is I would say is my favorite um, You know suit, but it looks too typical. It looks like the Zara blazer And I don't want to be done for like plagiarism copyright whatever you want to call it um so yeah, just so that I can let you know in terms of the process so far and how things have worked. Like I said, I've been on calls, I've been talking to different people, wholesalers. I started off here in the UK and I can't lie to you, it was too damn expensive. So I said, okay, I'm going to import this from elsewhere. And so I had some connects in some different places and I basically spoke to them and we managed to come up with like a reasonable price for the both of us, yada, yada, yada. And my laptop is about to die. We managed to like negotiate, come up with a reasonable price. And this is what we have so far. So yeah, I am planning to launch this on my birthday. So the timeline right now is tight. I, but me, I love a challenge and I always do things like that. Like, so right now it is the 7th of September. My birthday is on the 5th of November, which means we have one one two three four five six seven eight weeks which means it's no way wait one second exactly eight weeks exactly two months to actually finalize the suits figure out posting and packaging labels etc um get a shoot done and launch so there's a lot to do in eight weeks but i believe i can do it I believe I can do it. So what I'm gonna do now is I am gonna go because I haven't even brushed my teeth yet. I'm sorry, I'm just being really honest with you guys. I'm gonna go brush my teeth, 
have some breakfast, come back over to my laptop. I've actually got to film watch my news today. So I'm gonna sit down, do my script, film watch my news, get that out of the way and then go on to do everything else that I need to do across the day. I've been getting calls like crazy, different people have been calling me. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna sort out my day, including my PH tried to call me while I was on the Zoom call. Someone from my other team tried to call me. So there's a lot to get on with today, but welcome to the process guys. Morning, Temi. How are you? I'm doing well. I'm so sorry I missed your call. I was on another meeting and it ran over, but it was quite a, a big catch up because uh, we um it's my other power class team, so we hadn't actually spoken in ages. So um yeah, we had a lot to catch up on. But what's going on? How are you? What's happening? How can I help you? Um, so it's two main things really. Okay. Um, Yesterday night, Shana asked me about, I think we've discussed previously that, was it with Frontline Therapist, that um, Esther wanted that one influencer, like, sponsorship a month, wasn't it? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, um, I didn't, yeah, so it's about that. Was I know that you mentioned that you're going to try and get to do that. Was there any feedback from that? Let me check right now. 23rd of September. 23rd of September. Perfect. So once you've done that... Sorry, did you say that you feel that um, emailing people who are like brand, brand um, like coaches and business coaches would be a conflict of interest? So uh, this is what I'm saying. I'm, I think it might be, but I think some people might be willing to support another coach. They might be like, oh, no, do you know what? I'm down to support, blah, 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 blah. But some people might turn around and say no. That's what I'm saying. Find a few people. All right, y'all. It's now 11. It's time for me to make something to eat because your girl's hungry. And I haven't eaten just yet. It looks crazy. I've got some oil in on my edges. This is my secret formula that's basically helped me to grow my edges back. But it's time to put this hair down because I don't like having it up too long of the, the pool. I try to really, I've really been making effort, guys, to look after my edges. And at some point, I will tell you guys my secret. But until then, I will just tell you that I've got an oil formula that I have created. Um, but yeah, right now, I've got another call that I need to make, actually. This time to my pay hair. Granola, courtesy of the husband. Hello. Good morning, dear Cass. How you doing? Morning. I'm not too bad. How are you? I'm doing good. I'm doing good. I'm so sorry. I missed um your call. It's been like a bit back to back on um, some calls this morning. It felt like I was very popular today. People have just been calling me, calling me, calling me today. So I'm like, rah! Literally, everybody. Say that again. May, it's not even the afternoon yet, but yeah, I've just been getting calls. I'm like, wow. Basically, asking for when you know, when the final workshop will be finished, when the second day expects content. Yeah. I'm sure that, um, the designer has replied. Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, so if you could please reply to her, because I'm um, gonna, or you can ask as well when you, when she thinks the change is going to be made. Yeah. So I can please back. Yeah, I'm like, oh no, like. I love it, love the service, love what they offer, etc, etc. Um, but yeah, I also know that I think August was meant to be when we finished everything off, so, so yeah, I just need to be a bit quick with the response and, and whatnot, but cool. No worries. But yeah, all right, cool. Let me go sit on my laptop. I'm going to finish my food while I do that. And then I've got a couple of other things that I need to sort out. But yes, ma'am, all will be done. All right, cool. Thanks so much, Dorcas. You too. You too. Have a good day. A few moments later. You're watching The Breakfast Club. Charlamagne the guy.
crowd. We are the Breakfast Club. We got a special guest in the building. Yes, sir, the OG. Tracy Morgan. Tracy Morgan. Tracy Morgan. First of all, that, that is very fresh. Well, it's not fresh. This is truck. Truck jewelry. Oh, yeah, it's called trucks. Somebody said the other. I like this it. This is what I love, guys. So, <clears throat> guys, I'm back on my laptop. I had a few calls. Now I'm about to just write, literally just sit and write the script for Watchmen News, just in case you guys don't know and are not familiar. Um, I um, film a weekly, like, it's like a faith-based news program. I've shown you guys before in like one of my vlogs and stuff and it just happened that Tuesdays is when I film. The last couple of weeks I have not been on it, let me be very honest with you. So I'm trying to write a banging um, piece today. Um, I, for now, sorry guys, it's a bit loud because the window's open, it's really warm today, so the window has to be open um but yeah i write everything on my own for now anyway i do all of the content on my own write the scripts on my own and now um because the studio is currently on is currently closed i'm filming from home as well i've got all the equipment that i need to film and whatnot so i am doing that right now um so i'm gonna write the script get myself ready film and then the rest of my day will be for everything else that i have on my to-do list to do as well but yeah, that's what I'm going to do while watching the Breakfast Club interviews because I love listening to interviews with different people, hearing different people's stories, journeys. I just love it. It's really interesting. So today is Tracy Morgan. <laughs> I finished the script, grabbed something to eat. I ate one of our, um, I didn't even show you guys, but I ate one of the meal prep um, lunches that we put together because <laughs> your girl and um, my husband, doesn't. we do not have time to be cooking every day or whatever it is. So we literally meal prep our meals for the week, which is brilliant. Um, but yeah, now it's time to get some makeup done. I'm probably gonna watch something as I do my makeup. And then hopefully, I just want to spend about half an hour doing my makeup, film and be finished everything by about 5.30. Then I'm probably going to have a nap. After I have my nap, get up so I can do all the other bits and pieces that I wanted to do. Um, actually, no, after that, I've got to create reels. After I create the reels, then have a nap, then go and do some other bits and pieces because Ben's working late today, which is actually great for me because it gives me more time to do everything and hopefully take off everything off of my to-do list and have time to chill. So let's go. to be a warm day the sun is blasting the house is overly hot but thank god we're gonna do this hello my name is nissy t and welcome to watchman news breaking the breaking news now first to new york in the united states where the actor michael k williams was found dead in his apartment after what some are saying may have been due to a possible drug overdose Alrighty, guys as you can tell um oh. I look really cute hey um i'm tired because that was just a lot and it is hot so hot in here i do not understand why all of a sudden summer has decided to come when it's now september and everyone's trying to get back trying to get on with work but all of a sudden it's decided to heat up in this place but i'm done i'm done with filming watchman news for today 
um i'm now about to send all of the files to the guys that edit it and then at six o'clock i've got a catch-up like analytics meeting so we have these like monthly catch-up meetings with our clients and today there happens to be one so i'm gonna go on that in a bit as well so you guys will be able to see that i haven't just thought my gosh so i'm gonna stop talking so i can just catch a breath on um twitter especially and the direction that we've kind of spoken about um and then on instagram there's also been a really good growth on instagram actually um so we can see um it's currently 1945 but i know that it's grown from there i think it's like 195 something now um i should have actually looked just before i came on but um we are most certainly um you know increasing in numbers which is great and which is good um, especially where everything is organic you know there's not been any paid ads any paid revenue anything paid behind it this is just organic people connecting with the platform connecting with the brand being interested in what it is that um, you know we're doing with seven hours later <laughs> right beautiful people so back in the office i literally went heated up some meal prep it probably doesn't look that appealing on the camera but it actually tastes really really good as you would have seen i had my mentoring session group mentoring session with um, i can like actually say my business mentor kiwi springer who is bloody amazing like i would highly recommend um if you're looking for a business mentor as a woman and you just need structure, you need guidance, like I would highly recommend her. I signed up to a program in August, but literally when I say to you, let me try and put you guys here, because when I say to you guys, there was like, oh, sorry guys, you're seeing me or whatever. There was just like no time, not even no time. I just wasn't making the time to join her sessions because I was too busy. And there's like bugs coming in because it's so my window's open because it's so hot in here but the lights are attracting bugs but yeah not even because it was no time it was literally just because i was just doing too many other things then obviously i wasn't well and whatnot but now as you can tell this is me when i'm able to function at 110 percent. right now it's 10 p.m just came from qb session i was like doing a couple of bits and pieces as I was listening in on the session, I've got notes for days, like literally, like all of the highlighted pages is all QB session. There, 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 there. So much to implement. I've even set um called for a meeting with my team tomorrow. Cause I was like, yeah, we need to get on things now, now, now. So I've got a meeting with them tomorrow, my internal team. Um and yeah literally it's been back to back to back as you saw i had calls then we had a client um catch up meeting which is super exciting because our client has renewed their contract with us which is a big win <laughs> big 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 win um but yeah uh, renew their contract with us for another six months so um that's really really good and then straight after that i went on to my mentoring session um and right now seeing as i've got a bit of energy still left what i'm gonna do now is i'm gonna eat while i go over content so every tuesday or wednesday morning i go over the content that our content creators have created for our clients i do any corrections anything like that 
I am hoping and praying that soon this will no longer be my responsibility to do because it is long. But I do it and I'm going to do that. As soon as I'm done with that, I'm going to close my laptop and I'm going to be done for the day because I am starting to feel a little bit tired. I wipe off my face, probably have a shower and then just wait for my husband to come home so that we can chill out. But I'm, I'm actually, so I said at the beginning of the day, Front, most people would be like oh my gosh like you know having someone that works for themselves means they do long hours but i think this is why it's super important and this is some advice maybe to like women out there find somebody who um you both understand what you guys are doing because i could imagine obviously i'm not saying that i want this to be every day like i don't want it to be that my husband rolls home at 11 p.m every single day but i know that there's a season and there's a time for everything like right now now that i've got my energy back up these are the hours that i would normally do like i start i got up this morning had my first meeting this morning at what time 9 30 and it's now it's 10 past 10 and i'm still going um but that's because number one i love what i do but also number two because i've rested um and i'm well rested um, i'm well rested now um and my husband is out doing his thing and so it's not a case of like oh my gosh when is he gonna come home i've got my own stuff to do and i can't lie it's given me time to do extra stuff because if when he comes back i'm not gonna lie to you i just want to chill with him i want to relax with him so sometimes i'll be like oh, i'll leave that until tomorrow um but when he's not here and he has long days it actually helps because it means that i can stay focused on what i need to do and get on with other bits and pieces that i couldn't get done in the day so just a little bit of you know just a little thought for like i'm not saying that someone who has a nine to five can't be with somebody who is self-employed or whatever but just a thought because um it can put a strain on your relationship like when you are self-employed when you work for yourself the hours can be mad um things don't function the way that okay you know that you're leaving at seven o'clock in the morning or waking up at seven leaving at eight getting to work at nine finishing at five coming home by six having dinner etc like things don't work like that when you're self-employed um yeah so just having someone even if you're not doing the same thing but having someone that understands what you're doing understands what you're building understands to give you the space to do whatever like i literally told ben now we were talking and i was like i'm so sorry babe but i'm gonna go so that i can finish off what i need to do so that by the time you come back home we can just chill rather than me you know having to then think about oh i'm trying to finish work and he's around and whatever but anyway i'm rambling is this even recording okay allegedly it's recording um but now it's time to go through content and then I think this is going to be the last bit for today.